you know that you can count on me when I'm at City Hall to work with you. And I will commit today to your three demands and go farther. Okay. First, you'll be at the table. Second, we will fully fund your work so that you can pay folks. I know that you can't survive just on the good feelings you get from helping folks, right? That's the way the city treats you, right? That's not enough. We need to fully fund you and we need to make sure that we treat you with the respect to pay you when you do the work, right? What happened in the pandemic? At the time you were most important, the city cut your pay, stopped paying you, said, oh no, your contract says meet people in person. Excuse me, there's a pandemic going on, right? So you can count on the fact that I will be your partner in all three of those, but I wanna go a step further. When I was working here in the administration as the housing commissioner, and we were seeing the worst housing crisis, the Great Recession coming on, I knew our nonprofits, I knew all of you would be challenged. So I got together with a, some friends and I started a nonprofit myself called Greater New York. And Greater New York mentors and helps the leaders of nonprofits through crisis. That's the work. And guess what? 10 years later, I'm still on the board and we're facing another crisis. And so we've been reaching out to nonprofits to make sure you're not just getting paid, you're not just getting your indirect rate, but that we're actually supporting you in ways that can ensure that you're becoming the institutions, that you're growing, you have the working capital, you can invest in your leadership and staff and boards, all of the things that are gonna be required to make you the leaders this city needs in crisis after crisis. So that's my fourth commitment to you, that I'm gonna work with you to be the best organizations that you can in every way that I can. That's who I've been through my last 30 years as a New Yorker, a lifelong New Yorker, and as someone who's worked at nonprofits to start my career, and it's who I will be as mayor.